Hi, I'm Dr. Balani. Some of my patients requested me to come to this forum and share my thoughts and uh, the concepts uh, that I live with every day. And it's my pleasure to do so. Having read the posts on these forums, I must say I absolutely empathize with your skepticism. It's something I see every day as rarely keratotomy patients fly to me from all over the world. Different countries, different cultures, different professions, different upbringing, but all of them had the same level of uh, pain, hurt, skepticism, uh, being told nothing can be done. So I'm used to um, seeing all this and I certainly appreciate where you all are coming from. So let me first start by saying, you don't need to be my patient. You don't need to come to me. In fact, if you could just stay with your eye surgeons in your states, countries, wherever you are, and encourage them to do what I've been teaching for the last decades, three decades, and through my own patient's eyes, inspiring them to not give up on real keratotomy patients, you would be doing me a favor. So if you could encourage your doctors to take care of you and not give up, that would really make me very happy. Of course, I'm always here for you, but just clarifying this right off the bat, you don't need to come to me, all right? Now, another very important thing is, my institute does not advertise, does not do any marketing, does not do any spiels, any deals, discounts, uh, uh, technology hypes, or any referral fees or any such gimmicks. It is our pride uh, in what we do and how we care for each and every patient that comes here. So it's very important that you do your research. And I must say, I'm so touched to see my patients on this forum, uh, how hard they have tried to give hope and share with you all their experiences. Remember again, none of my patients are even ordinary people. These are some of the most accomplished people in the world and despite their busy schedule, they have gone out of their way to help you and share the information and knowledge uh, from us uh, to literally help real keratotomy patients all over the globe. So another very, very important point I want to stress on right away is none of my patients are incentivized. They have no incentive to do so. In fact, many of them come here after tremendous research they have done after seeing many eye surgeons in their states and countries and also uh, very skeptical quite often. And these are uh, patients who are very intelligent, as I said. They have done their research, even read medical uh, publications before coming over. And then they travel to me and I accept them. I empathize with their pain and I go and start just understanding their level of complexities of real keratotomy and how to help them see. And also one more thing here. I don't guarantee anybody any outcomes. I cannot. I mean, many of my patients say, Dr. Galani, just tell everybody you're amazing. That'd be an easy way out because I do have a track record of success where so many of my patients are seeing, and majority of them, no matter how severe with their RK, are seeing without glasses and contact lenses. But I don't guarantee that, as you can tell, because each one of you is uniquely complex. As I've mentioned many times before, it's not just the number of cuts you have, but the associated problems along with the real keratotomy cuts that makes each one uniquely complex and difficult, not only anatomically, physically, but also optically, visually, because you still have your RK cornea. So these are very important aspects I want to share with you. So just seeing the amount of time my real keratotomy patients, the ones I have worked on, have spent uh, on this forum uh, to inspire all other RK patients and give hope to them, um, I just want to say thank you from the bottom of my heart because there is no incentive for them. And um, it's such a pleasure to see them uh, spread my passion because my goal ultimately is to inspire my profession, my colleagues, uh, eye surgeons, uh, optometrists, eye care providers of all levels to not give up on you, real keratotomy patients, very important. So on this forum, I've been presented with uh, six of the most common questions that are repeatedly asked and I will make separate videos for you uh, on those, otherwise these videos will become too long. Uh, as you know, I do everything impromptu. Uh, there is no preparation, I need no rehearsal. It just comes from my heart, all the knowledge over three decades that I've accumulated um, in the privilege of helping uh, patients from all over the world, especially RK patients. So the six most common questions I've been given are, is Dr. Gulani real? I am, I am real, see this hurts. <laughs> also, uh, you know, how come other eye surgeons are not performing what Dr. Golani has been doing and showing results over the last three decades? Uh, next question I get a lot is, since our radial keratotomy surgery failed us, what if Dr. Golani's work is really not the right direction in the future? 
Next is the new lens technology uh, implant advertising and hype that we are hearing. What are the new lenses for real keratotomy cases and uh, why should we not go in that direction? Then there are other questions of we are happy with our uh, eyes because we are wearing scleral or other specialty contact lenses and we are seeing good enough. Why should we have surgery? And then finally it is we have been told nothing can be done. How come Dr. Galani says there are options? And then the last question is most important that I've been getting on this forum is how do we differentiate between uh, the real deal, a surgeon who's actually producing results for the last few decades on patients from all over the world of all kinds of severe radial keratotomy patients and compare that to doctors who are advertising and calling themselves specialists for RK patients. So I will address all these six questions for you in separate videos, impromptu, one-on-one, -on -one. I promise I will. And it's really my pleasure. Once again, what I have done is something I don't need to do. I have put all my patients on camera live during surgery, many of them even before surgery, to show you how the testings and diagnostics go and how dedicatedly a doctor has spent hours and hours with them to plan their surgeries. And then showing them during surgery live, immediately post-surgery, day after surgery, and then decades after surgeries when they come back. All these videos are of real patients with no incentive. And all of these patients are complex. They're not even predictable of where I'm gonna land. And yet I've been doing this to inspire my profession and maybe give hope to patients that you don't need to um, be let down that nothing can be done. You can be helped. Once again, this is Dr. Golani. Our website, golanivision.com, has lots of information. Our YouTube has videos not only of patient reactions and information, but also of surgical footage, live surgical footage of these kind of cases. And I promise to answer your six questions when I'm back. Until then, Dr. Golani.